3D holographic technology has often been seen as a thing of the future, but the reality is that this technology already exists. Currently, it is being used in the military and medical fields, but in the future, it has the potential to be used in classrooms to transform learning. The biggest benefit of 3D holograms in the classroom is that they enable students to visualize difficult concepts. Holograms can help students to experience the concepts like they would in the real world, in real time. Students can experience what it would be like to see a whale up close, true to size. Or students can look at the inside of the human body in a 3D format. Another benefit of holographic technology is that it encourages collaboration and communication between students, as opposed to if each student were working alone on his or her own laptop. Lastly, this technology allows students to learn and experience real-world experiences in a risk-free environment. Initially, I thought that one of the drawbacks might be that teachers might be hesitant to use this technology because it is such a new and unknown tool. However, a 2010 study showed that the majority of teachers surveyed believe that 3D holographic technology is a beneficial tool for the classroom. There are some possible issues with this technology, one of which is the eye strain that has been reported after viewing the 3D holograms for an extended period of time. Some students also reported feeling disoriented or dizzy after viewing the 3D images. Another issue that can occur with 3D holograms is that some holograms may not be completely accurate or may come off as cartoonish instead of working as a valid teaching tool. Hopefully holograms will become more accurate over time. A final consideration, and perhaps the biggest, is cost. Currently, the technology is running around $9,000 at the low end, making it very inaccessible for schools. In time, however, the price is likely to come down, and companies are also likely to look at ways to make the technology more affordable. Like all technologies, of course there will be some schools that may not be able to afford it, although it seems like it will be beneficial for those who can. Although this technology does have its drawbacks, I personally think that it will be very beneficial for students in the future. As teachers, we are always striving to provide our students with real-world examples and experiences, and this technology would help us to do that. I also think that this type of technology would be engaging and motivating for students. It definitely is the epitome of interactive learning in my book. Hopefully, in time, this technology will become more accessible and affordable for students everywhere.